Hi everyone, my name is Ilana Orlovsky and I'm the marketing manager at Imbibe, which is a product development company focused on the design and formulation of beverage ingredients like flavors, sweetener systems, and stabilizers, as well as finished beverages just outside of Chicago. So I'm not a scientist, right? I already told you I'm in marketing. So my relationship with the lab is really in the visibility that I have, which contributes to my understanding of the market as a whole and also helps me identify opportunity areas and areas of growth since I watch products being developed often six to nine months before they hit the market. So one thing that I've noticed in the past couple years is an uptick in the number of plant-based milks and other plant-based projects that, that we work on. So with the recent, meteoric rise, we have to ask why, right? So health and wellness, of course, is a huge driver. This is a top priority of consumers. 15 to 30% of adults in North America report some kind of lactose intolerance or sensitivity. And then there's also, of course, these um, environmentally conscious consumers that are constantly looking for more ways, more sustainable ways to help feed the entire populace. So my presentation will look at some of these contributing factors, what's contributing to the growth of the US market, which is currently valued at $2.3 billion, what the variety of ingredients are and sort of what's being called out, which ones are likely to gain mainstream adoption, which ones may fall by the wayside and why. So if you want to gain a better understanding and kind of a landscape of what's happening in the plant-based milk segment and leave with a clearer picture as to where the white space is, I hope you vote for my panel picker presentation, Cover Your Bases with Plant-Based Milks. Hope to see you in Austin next year. Thanks so much.